Right now, I am stuck in traffic on my way to the Radwood house for Radwood at HoopDeCon. Actually, I should start this by, uh, this is another off the cuff, DWA off the cuff. And uh, yeah, so I'm in traffic. I am, uh, I left work and our house we're staying in for Radwood at Sonoma Raceway is about 60 miles away from my work. And um, it's gonna be about two and a half hours by the time I get there. So it's awesome. Um, <laughs> it's just all commute traffic in the Bay Area here. I had to go through San Francisco, through the city over the Golden Gate Bridge, and uh, now I'm heading up towards Petaluma, gonna hang out with a bunch of the, the guys tonight at the Radwood house, um, kinda have fun, drink some beers, and do a little prep for the show. I'm driving the 944 with its beat up front end and everything, and I have it full of crap. I have all the t-shirts and uh, a couple tables, uh, four chairs, uh, podcast recording equipment, uh, trying to think what else, some banners, a bunch of stuff for the show. Um, it's looking like the weather is going to hold off, which is, it's, it's touch and go. So, um, but I don't think if it rains at all, it's going to be really minor. So I think we're going to have an awesome show tomorrow. I can't wait. I think it's going to be a blast with all the other events going on and like the gambler is going to be there and. Um, you know the Gambler 500. Who we have we had the the uh, guy who started on our podcast. I don't know six months ago or so, or maybe it was a year ago by now. Um, but yeah, and then there's gonna be Concourse Thin Lemons and Billet Proof, and then a 24 Hours of Lemons going on, and a film festival hosted by Matt Farah. Um, we did submit our. Mighty Max video, but we submitted it yesterday, uh, which might have been too late. I don't know. I mean, we do have a little bit of an in, but uh, we'll see. And then um, <clears throat> I'm trying to think. Oh, and then they're doing like a barbecue engine, barbecue cook-off. Uh, it should be just super fun. And then we have, we have a donut truck and a food truck at our event. We have uh, our friend Darren, my my good friend from high school, is uh, driving up from San Diego to DJ. Uh, he also DJed the Radwood in LA, and uh, yeah, it should be tons of fun. It's fun getting together with all the guys, um, you know, hanging out with Rick and Brad and um, get, you know Brian, Warren, Art. Uh, you have Mikey from Clutch Kick, and then all those guys. Uh, we're gonna meet uh, today with uh, Chris from Clutch Kick is flying in from uh, I Ohio or wherever those guys are from. <coughs> and uh, yeah, so this is just I'm um, driving up right now, and I'll, I'll try and um, I'll try and get our house and do a little more stuff. So uh, you'll see me in a snap. I forgot to record anything when I got into the Airbnb last night. Um, but we had a good night. There was about 10 of us at the Airbnb. Now we're headed to the racetrack for uh, HoopDeCon. And it is 7, like 7.20 in the morning. So I'll see you there. Right, Sonoma Raceway. Arrived. Here we are at Sonoma Raceway. Just getting ready for Radwood at HoopDeCon. You can see the line of cars coming in. There's the upside down car from Lemons. That's the uh, lot for uh, just normal people and stuff. And then there's part of the billet proof show, like fenced off right there. And then you come around and this is the Radwood Royalty lot right here. And then up on that hill, on the grass that's all for normal radwood so this is our spot um and it's all overlooking sears point raceway the whole track pretty rad so a couple cars have already showed up we have a 242 volvo gt and a mitsubishi 3000 and then just all of our cars gabe nash and e30 my 944 arts sec 
Hi Chris, how are you? No opinion. No opinion. No opinion. Hey, which is the longest car here? <laughs> I, is there a 2002 around here? Oh yeah, 2002 are known for being just so long. <laughs> Biggest cars out here, Mikey, man. Mikey, that's a nice hat. Where'd you get that? Thank you. Uh, they're for free, right over yeah, there. Yeah, I mean, we need to make a free sign. That's something someone can do. Oh, yeah. Why don't I have one? You what? should definitely wear one. It's really cool. Um, so yeah, here we are. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm just doing a little video stuff for Radwood. 2018 HoopDecon. There's the DW Podcast Studio remote. Back the floor. Video game station with a period correct CRT TVs. New on a week out looking to fly. Hard ski. What up? Some JDM stuff. Eva 6.5, Tommy Mac Edition. Porsche 959, Mercedes 500E. A bunch of cool stuff, as you can see. I just bought a bunch of diamond parts for it. I'm gonna put all on it later. Pretty soon, Very so. cool. It's a beautiful car, man. Uh, yeah, right, I can't no, have one. Good. You're done. Remember? I know. Yeah, I always get harassed because I say it because I'm done. Yeah. And then, I, and then a, a year later, I'm like, I kind of want another one again, even though I said I would never buy another one. Uh, but yeah, I know. I'm, I'm, Slick top, estrogen blue, black interior would be cool. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. that's one that I'd like to have. The techno violet's good too. Yeah, it's hard to find the techno. called a wakaba. It means a young leaf. So you get three young leaves. Congrats. All right, uh, anybody want a Pez? It's a Darth Vader Pez. Oh, yeah. Anybody, okay, did anybody bring a kid that wants a Pez? You brought a kid? There you go. There you go. You want this uh, F50 to? There you go. Cool. I emptied out my closet. <laughs> All right. Um, we got a lot of t-shirts. Yeah, there's still a couple t-shirts. All right, you might have a hard time hearing me. We're heading back from Radway to Hoop Decon. I'm in the 944. And I have two tables and eight metal chairs in the back. So that's the rattling you hear. I'm following uh, Brian and Project CRNN. And we're going back to the Radwood house. Um, and then probably just going out to dinner in Petaluma or something. Killer day. Um, I didn't have a chance to like get as much footage as I wanted, of course, because I was busy and uh, the show went really well. We had tons of cars. It was awesome. Um, you'll see. You would have seen that in a little bit of the video. But uh, just want to thank everyone for coming out. Um, everyone who helped us. All our friends, you know, everything it was a blast. Uh, we did get to do some laps around the track at the end, a little parade lap, which was cool. And uh, it was just a really successful day, and uh, thanks to everyone involved and everyone that came, because you guys made it a success. Uh, yeah, so that is a wrap. Um, hopefully, you know, we recorded a podcast today, but um, I think the next podcast is going to be the one where we really get to, you know, talk about what everything you know really we'll be able to kind of we'll, we'll be able to really have soaked everything in that went on today and everything so um great event and uh thanks for watching bye